canine behavioral issues. Hi, I'm Dr. Ortiz, a veterinarian at Banfield Pet Hospital. As your partner in pet care, it's our goal to help keep your pet healthy and happy. Today, we're going to share some information with you about canine behavioral issues. Aggressive dogs can be dangerous toward you and others, including children. Dogs can become aggressive for many reasons, including fear, predatory or territorial behavior, pain, or unfamiliar circumstances. Dogs that have fear-related aggression tend to show their behavior toward unfamiliar people or animals. Many factors may cause fear, including the lack of socialization or an association with a negative experience. When a fearful dog is cornered or feels threatened, they are most likely to become aggressive. Predatory behavior is very different than other forms of aggression, since there isn't an intimidation or threat causing the aggression. One example of predatory behavior is dogs chasing squirrels. If a dog exhibits this behavior to a socially unacceptable target, like to a cat or an infant, there is the potential for harm. Dogs who have territorial aggression typically respond in a hostile way to unfamiliar people or animals coming into their territory. This behavior may become intensified when the dog is on a leash or confined. Aggression can also be triggered by pain or illness. Your Banfield veterinarian may recommend a physical exam and testing to rule out illness or injury as a possible cause of the aggressive behavior. Many aggressive behaviors can be modified with a thorough behavioral evaluation and modification treatment program. Your Banfield veterinarian will recommend ways to reduce your pet's anxiety and make any interaction with them much safer and more pleasant. Dogs often try to escape because they're not getting enough exercise or social interaction with other dogs or people. Many unneutered male dogs are more prone to roaming because of their instinctual drive to reproduce. Neutering helps calm this desire and thus the desire to roam. Because they're less likely to roam, it also decreases their chances of becoming lost, struck by a car, or involved in territorial fights on another dog's turf. Dogs who are bored, who don't get enough exercise, or who have separation anxiety can become destructive. If your pet becomes excited, depressed, or anxious when you're preparing to leave or when you return, they might be showing symptoms of separation anxiety. These include becoming destructive in the home or outside when people aren't present, depression, barking, whining excessively, and house soiling. Dogs with separation anxiety cannot control their behavior and should never be punished for it. Behavior modification, including training your pet to become more comfortable with you being away, as well as basic obedience courses, can be very helpful. It helps to reinforce positive behaviors when you leave and return. Rewarding a calm pet will encourage your pet to not display negative behaviors like hyperactive greetings, jumping, and pawing. It also helps to keep goodbyes and hellos low key, which lessens the emotional roller coaster some pets may experience when you come and go. Your Banfield veterinarian can prescribe medication to help reduce separation anxiety, but will be most effective when used together with modifying your pet's environment and behavior. Changing your dog's negative behavior is not a short-term process, but with dedication and consistency, and the help from your Banfield veterinary team, the outcome can be a positive and enduring relationship between you and your pet. Thanks for listening. Remember, you know your pet best, and we know how to help you keep them healthy.